Welcome back to Studio STO. You know, fine art, live jazz, great food, and drinks all under one roof. We're talking about the dark room at the Grand L. It's operated by the Kranzberg Arts Foundation, and it could be the place to take your date. <laughs> Several places we may have for you. Joining me is a person who loves to scope out great things to do and places to visit. It is Morgan Casey with Daters and Doers. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Good to see you. And uh, all right, let's talk, let's talk about the dark room. It's not just for photographers anymore, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, not at all. It's actually like the perfect place. If you're looking for like a romantic date, um, you know, I, me and Donna, we went there maybe about a month ago, and I think we've been every weekend since then. No kidding. Yeah, the music is great. Um, they recently established a partnership with Alonzo Townsend, and so, you know, they're known for jazz music. However, he's been bringing in a whole, you know, array of different artists, and it's been awesome. So there's several different vibes in this one place. Yes. I mean, so you can kind of find which one fits you. Yeah, definitely check out their websites and see a lineup of all the different artists coming. That's really cool. Really cool. All right. Uh, next up, how about Crave Coffee House? This is another, yes. another one of your favorite spots. It is. Reason being, like one of the reasons is because I need coffee mostly on Mondays. <laughs> <laughs> and right? it's hard to find a coffee shop open on a Monday, but they're open. Um, not only that, the, the atmosphere is amazing. It's in a church, which I think is really I've been neat. in this place before. It is a cool vibe. It, it really is. As soon as you walk in, it's just like you feel safe. You feel at home. Yes. Um, and then they also have like a lot of cool events on weekends. Uh, they have a yoga event. I don't know like how I would do, but I might check it out. <laughs> hey, give it a try. Why I not? can see you doing it. I would do it. You, I'll go if you go. Yeah, my tree pose is a little timber. Just, <laughs> just saying. But uh, hey, we, we, one other thing about this spot is they serve pretty good food too. Crave coffee. They house. do. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, my favorite is the Chipotle chicken sandwich. Yes. You gotta try that. Good, and it's it's nestled right in there in on the SLU campus, right? Yes, yeah, yeah. It's awesome. It's a cool location. It is a really cool location. All right, if you need something a little more extreme, how about a little axe throwing? Yes. So we have a brand new location um, by the name of the Hatchet House, and it's located in St. Charles. They have axe throwing, but they also have karaoke, um, the VR, like the game system where you you put it over your eyes and you think you're there. Uh, <laughs> love it, love it. Uh, they also have wine flights. Flights are like the big thing that people are looking for nowadays. The big samplers, right? Yes. Yeah, yes. that's what they want. Yeah, that's what I want to. Okay, so if my karaoke's bad, that's not going to induce some axe throwing, is it? They're, yeah. they're separate entities, you know, right? <laughs> hopefully you sign a waiver or something. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you heard me sing, you may want to throw an axe. I'm just saying. That's a possibility. Have but you tried axe throwing? I have. It's, it's a little hard. It's, it's, it's hard. But it, it's it's kind of uh, stress relieving. Definitely, you know. <laughs> it's, it's, well, it's so <laughs> but getting it to stick is hard. That you know, it, yeah. Getting the right rotation down, knowing the speed. Yeah, forget the aiming. I just needed to just stick to the the board anywhere. Right. Just I'll be lucky. Get somewhere on the board. That's my goal. But it is. A, but it, it, you mentioned that all these places, especially the the Hatchet House. Very. Uh, inviting for like a first date like it's, yeah. it's kind of open it's casual it's fun not a lot of stress there yeah that, true it's a you know group of people if you don't like the date you can you know hide <laughs> <laughs> i'm gonna go do karaoke you throw some hatchets for a while we'll meet up in a little bit so tell me about about the 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 site though because it's got to be yeah. blowing up with people Wanting to get back out and get into doing things. Have you seen this an increase? Oh, it's, in it's been insane. I mean, we started it during a pandemic. So right. to see a good number of people looking for things to do during that time. And then yeah. as it's opening back up, it's the numbers are insane. Why do you think that is? Why? Why are people so? Well, I've heard a lot of men personally tell me that our site has helped them find things to do for their wives. I literally I kid you not had someone come up to me recently and tell me we saved their marriage. And I'm like, you can, no. <laughs> This therapist making good money for that. Come on, give Very me true. a little no. scratch. A little extra. Yeah, no, it's it, it's awesome. I mean, we made People Magazine last week, and um, so it's really cool to just see the love that we're getting not only from St. Louis but from all around the world. So you oh, you're getting international traffic. Yeah, well, we're in 16 different cities now. Wow. Yeah, St. Louis is our largest. That's our hometown, but we're growing. And you bigger bigger growth plans for you? Yeah, this is what I do full time now. So you, you just want to take this thing all over? All over. I love that. We've, we're in Kenya. I have a group of five in Kenya. you got to be kidding. That's yeah. awesome. That is awesome. And, and traffic's going to keep going because people are looking out there. And, and I tell you, as a fellow, always looking for date ideas, you need them. Yeah. I mean, you'd think you'd hear about them more, but you need someone like you to tell us the places we're missing because there's a lot out there. Yeah, it is. St. Louis, there's so much to do. 
one of the one things I hated uh, to hear is there's nothing to do here when it's, there's so much. Yeah, you're, so you're much. proving them wrong on that front. How can people get in touch with you? Well, definitely Facebook, uh, Date Ideas and Things to Do and STL. Um, and also we're on TikTok, which is a really cool one. And um, Instagram as well. You do the TikTok dances? You know, Donna <laughs> keeps me from doing that, embarrassing her. <laughs> there you go. Daters and doers, so check them out. They'll give you some great ideas on some things to do right here in the loop. Hey, keep it here. We got more coming your way at the Studio STL on a Monday. We'll be right back.